So to get started, you're going to need to find the, the executable direct, uh, file that's XS61850 Explorer. And when this screen opens up, you're going to go into addressing. And you're going to see a bunch of default settings in here. Uh, for the client and server, leave them at their default values. Now, I'm going to configure the two relays that I have that I'm working with. Uh, both. Uh, so the way you do it is by selecting Add give the relay name I'll call it UR1 you insert the IP address and if I want to insert another one I can select insert and I'll change the IP address of the second one select OK and I now have it populated here I'll select OK Now, next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to the physical devices. You're going to right click. You're going to add your device. I'll give the device name the same, UR1. And just leave everything at its default. And down here under the AR names, just going to go down to the first one and select UR1. Save it. Wait a minute. So right now it's trying to establish communications with the relay. Now we'll add in our second relay. And here we'll select the, the second one that we configured. We'll save that. Now that we've got the two relays uh, configured, we can exit.